I've been so alone ever since I left the tribe. That's just how it goes, guess I like the Hello, great people on the internet. Today, I'm going to be counting down the top 5 most beautiful places in Australia. So let's get right into it. Okay, so up first we have Hiller Lake in Western Australia, also known as the Pink Lake for its bubblegum pink colour. The lake is 600 metres long and is surrounded by dense forests to make it so you can't get there without flying. The lake turns pink because of algae in the water, and other than that, it's just an ordinary salt lake. You can swim in it safely, and it's definitely a beautiful one. Coming up next, we've got Lake Mackenzie in Australians, Fraser Island. One of the most beautiful places I've seen to date. The lake does not receive water from any stream or other sources, but rainwater. The sand is pure white and super soft to walk on. And also helps that the water is crystal clear because of the sand acting as a base. And it's a great tourist destination for hikers and campers. Next up, we got Daintree Forest. The forest is located in the northeast coast of Queensland and is the largest continuous area of tropical rainforest in Australia. The ecosystem is unrivaled with its plant diversity and it's a great tourism destination. What more can you ask for in a rainforest? There's even white beaches connecting it to the coast. Next up, we got Lucky Bay. The bay is one of Australia's most well-known beaches and is located on the south coast of Western Australia in the Cape Le Grand National Park. It has crystal clear water and pristine white sand similar to Lake Mackenzie. And if you love kangaroos, you're in luck because they're fairly common to see on the bay. And lastly, we got Whitehaven Beach. Damn, we have some pretty nice beaches in Australia. Whitehaven Beach is located in Whitsunday Island off the coast of central Queensland. And it is also accessible by boat. Once you are there, you are met with stunning crystal clear waters and amazing views. Also, you won't have any problems with the white sand burning your feet since it doesn't retain heat. That's all I got for now. Thanks for watching. And if there's anything you think should be on the list, then write a comment down below. I would love to know about it. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like, maybe subscribe. I'd greatly appreciate it. And until next time, see ya.